Hey guys. Man, I really need a haircut. I'm starting to get a fro. So last weekend I was part of a concert that celebrated the opening of a new state-of-the-art concert hall on campus. The concert was actually live-streamed on the internet and some of you lasties um, watched me. It was pretty cool actually to have people around the world um, watching me. It was like you guys were in the audience and cheering me on. I actually had a friend in the audience who brought his video camera and sort of illegally recorded one of my performances. Here's a clip of it. The cool thing about my friend's video is that it's mostly centered around me, as opposed to the live stream, which wasn't. So if you missed the live stream or you wanted to see me sing, then uh, link is in the doobly-doo. In response to Sully's question, I don't actually have a nightstand, but I do leave my phone next to my pillow so that right when I go to bed and right when I wake up, I can check the forum and check my email. In response to Kelly's question, my favorite squeal-worthy YouTuber is probably Finn Harry's, even though he doesn't have his own YouTube channel. He's the twin of Jack's cap. Link is in the doobly-doo. In response to Leon's question, I'm still reading Looking for Alaska. Um, I am... 185 pages in, so I'm almost done. That'll probably be my last book that I've read next week. The last book that I actually read and finished is probably Horatio Alger's Mark the Match Boy, which is the third book in the Ragged Dick series from the 1860s. I read it on the Kindle app on my iPad, which is pretty awesome for reading a book that's been out of print for probably at least 50 years. I answered Leon's second question of what is my favorite book in last week's video, so go check that out if you haven't seen it. I think that's enough questions for Cat and Taylor to answer, so I guess I'll see you guys next week. Bye. Also, I'm totally winning. Arrgh.